Welcome to Couple Movie Watchers. In today's video, we're going to talk about Hereditary. Yes, it's the movie that she forced me to watch <laughs> that recently that's on Showtime. Mm -hmm. It's one of the few movies they have on there, so we're going to talk about it. So stay tuned. All right, welcome back. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. It really helps out the channel. Today, we're going to talk about how I was forced to watch Hereditary. And tell me, why was I forced to watch this today? Uh, I wanted to see it again. And I wanted to see what you thought about it. Because it's a really interesting movie. Yes, it's very interesting. Um, yeah, it's an it's a, it's a interesting movie. Being forced to watch it, I thought it was filmed really well. The atmosphere, it kind of keeps you know, a little bit on edge with the suspense. Mm -hmm. The sound design is really well done for a scary slash drama and mystery film. Mm-hmm. Overall, I thought it was a good movie. The ending to me was kind of lacking. I felt, I guess it did answer some questions, but overall it just felt, I'm not really in the horror genre type of things. Mm -hmm. I know you love it, so I'm not the one, for a guy who doesn't like horror as much as you do, except the zombie films, mm -hmm. I thought it was filmed really well. The acting was good. It has some good little scary moments and spots. I just didn't feel the ending. Mm. It's just, just what it is. I think I didn't know what this movie was about. I just knew they were kind of promoting it. And I think my siblings were like kind of talking about it. They're like, oh, you know, let's watch this and this and that. And I wasn't really in the beginning. I saw it. I was kind of like weird out with everything that was happening. But it's mostly about like dealing with death. Like, you know, when somebody passes away or something like that, it's like kind of like, how do you deal with that? You know what I mean? Yeah, dealing with death, uh, coping with tragedy, loss, and everything that comes with it and the things that... It just shows different type of uh, feelings and expressions of people. Mm -hmm. And then I just felt like it was something that you don't really see. A lot of the time, it's mostly somebody haunting somebody or you know doing cold stuff but this one it was kind of like showing the emotions of somebody losing somebody and it was just kind of like interesting to see um you know from her like annie was she lost her mom in the beginning and then you know she didn't really feel that connection with her compared to somebody else that passes away um you see the difference you know, in her expressing herself. I think the movie probably would have been better if we had more info on the grandmother. Mm -hmm. It just kind of felt, I don't know, it just felt, if it was it was a good movie for what it is. If you like this type of stuff, I, I can see why people would like it. For me, I just, the more I think about it, the more I'm, I'm just, I feel like when I'm, look, I'm looking at the poster now, you see the daughter, the daughter and the mother Mm -hmm. Well, it's kind of hard to say the daughter and the mother because the mother is also the daughter because there's a grandmother mm -hmm. in this case. But when you look at the poster, it has you thinking one way. Mm -hmm. This is a movie you have to go in without looking at any pictures because if you look at any pictures... No, like, no looking at the background of it. <laughs> no background, no pictures because you watch anything, it's going to ruin the suspense of the movie. Yeah, I just didn't like how, how it ended. You know, I, I'm mm -hmm. more of a, I don't want to say a Disney person, but... You, know, you wanted a happy ending? Not necessarily a happy ending, but most most of these movies don't have a happy ending. The sadness about it. I I was just really freaking out because I feel like stuff like that does happen. I don't know. Yeah, they got these cults out there, so you know, I'm pretty sure it does, but I don't know. So it's just like a creepy thing to see because it's it's those type of movies where I mean I mean I've seen it and it still freaks me out, but that's why I wanted to see what you thought. Yeah, no. Uh, watching I, it was good watching it. I can't say I dis I disliked it because watching it did keep me in suspense. It made me want to see what's gonna happen. But just the ending, just it just it, at least it answered some questions because there was a point when it ended. I was like, well, if it ends right now, this movie sucks. But mm -hmm. it kept going and he kind of wrapped up a lot of things that you want them to answer. Mm -hmm. But I didn't necessarily. You weren't satisfied with it. 
I didn't necessarily like the answers that they gave. Mm -hmm. There was nothing wrong with the answers that led them there, mm -hmm. led the audience to where they were going to go. Watching a movie, looking at the posters, you're looking for certain characters to kind of be the lead in the film, and they're not necessarily the lead. They are, but they aren't. The story's not really, like, if you have to go back without giving any spoilers, who who's this movie really about? Uh, her son. Is it really, though? Well, actually, it's about Annie, actually. But is it really, though? Why you don't think it's... I think it, overall it's about the whole family. Yeah, it's kind of like a, a mixture of the whole family except the dad. The dad was kind of useless. But <laughs> yeah. outside of the dad... It was more about like the grandma and the grandchildren with the with the mom. But was it really... Did we really know anything about the grandmother? I mean, they explained that at the end. You have to go in there just not... With no expectations. Can't look at the posters. It it was it was a decent movie. I I I just the more I think about it, I just didn't really care for the ending. All right, that's all I gotta say. Anything for you? No, that's good. Perfect. Do you recommend it to people watch this on Showtime or wherever it's gonna be at in the future? Yeah, it's a interesting it's interesting movie. <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say. All right, well that's all for us, and uh, until next time, peace.